Leaving Budva for Podgorica, you can admire the surroundings of Budva from a bird's eye view at the parking lots of the mountain road. A mountain road leads to Podgorica at an altitude of at least more than one kilometer, so when leaving a warm climate, expect coolness or even snow at the top. The city of Podgorica itself is located in a lowland among the mountains, so the temperature there is not much different from the seaside resorts of the country, but with the exception of possible strong gusts of wind. On the outskirts of the city center, we are greeted by numerous nondescript shopping malls surrounded by residential areas of four to six story buildings. We are moving towards the center. Podgorica is the capital of Montenegro, located in the central part of the country on the banks of the Moricha River. The name of the city comes from two words and literally means located under the mountain, as the city is surrounded by mountains. In the central part of the city is quite green, there are many park areas and trees planted along the roads. The beginning of the cultural center is symbolized by the Hilton Hotel. Residents of the city are mainly engaged in trade, tourism and agriculture. The city also has the status of the cultural and economic center of the region, with historical sites and modern infrastructure facilities. The old Muslim quarter is located next to Ivan Milutinovich Park. Quiet mostly well-groomed streets among the private sector and the mosque among them, you can walk there for 20 minutes. Podgorica is a popular tourist destination, mainly as a short stop due to its location on the way to this Jabliak ski resort, Dormitor National Park and the famous Djurjevic Bridge over the Tara River. Moving on, we approach the local city hall, several streets with restaurants, boutiques and expensive offices diverge from it. In good weather, most of the townspeople spend time here, meeting, chatting, and enjoying delicious snacks and drinks. We are moving to the next attraction of the city, the Moricha River and the modern cable state Mylenium Bridge, from which you can admire the strong current of the river and its clear mountain water.
On the other side of the river, we are waiting for more modern neighborhoods with a number of modern glass office and trade buildings, that part is good for going to the shops. Also on the other side there is a large shopping mall with famous international brands, as well as a food court and entertainment for children, where you can have a good time, especially in bad weather, which happened here in the off season. As the main trip, the city is not as interesting as seaside resort towns, but as a stop on the way to Zjabliak or Dormitor for 1-2 to two hours of walking is the best. We also recommend it to those who want to go shopping. Thank you for your attention and interest. Subscribe, like, and wait for new releases. Bye.